Hey everybody, I'm coming to y'all today from the room in my house known as my Casbah. Love to curl up under these Casbah curtains behind me and take special naps and just chill or read books, play with my dolls and my toys. It's a special place to me. I came today because I wanted to show y'all this headband that I have made. I am so in love with it. I just made it this evening. The glue is not even dry, y'all. It might just come falling down at any minute, but I don't think so. The other day, my husband wanted to uh, go over to Toys R Us because they're going out of business, and he was hoping to find some marked down things, and I went along with him. The only thing I saw in there that I was really crazy about was a pom-pom headband, much like this one, only... If I say so myself, not quite as cute. I wasn't willing even at the 30% off markdown price to pay that for a pom-pom headband. And lo and behold, a few days later, when I was in my own home uh, Dollar Tree, I saw packages of pom-poms. I could not believe my eyes. Um, the package that I have right here is a different color scheme than the one that I took the ones out of that are in my headband right now. I bought two different packages because of course, if there's two different kinds of colors, I've got to get them both. But anyway, they're really super cool. And also, the the band is one of a multi-pack of little thin headbands that I buy all the time in Dollar Tree. And I just whomped them on here with hot glue. And I love it so much. And also, while I was there, I saw these really cool little butterflies. They're kind of three-dimensional. I love them. They came in two different color schemes also. These blues and a more brown, orange, goldish one. Um, I have the brown, goldish one at my work office hanging on the wall beside a little... Um, stone cross and they're all just like placed around it and it just is beautiful i mean it makes a gorgeous little vignette of beauty right there on my wall and i loved it so much another thing that i think y'all have probably picked up on although i'm not sure people i am crazy about the letter w I mean, I always have been. And when I married my husband and got W for a last name also, I was just like, in heaven, it seemed too good to be true. It was magical to me. And I'm all the time picking up W's everywhere I go. Well, I was in Dollar Tree the other day. I've never seen letters. Like, this is a magnetic W. I've never seen letters in Dollar Tree before. And would y'all believe it? The only one in there was this one, and it happens to be a W. I mean, I don't know about y'all, but that seems like a little more than just serendipity to me. But I can tell you one thing. I just scarfed it up quick and put it in my cart. Also, I've been meaning to tell y'all every time for the last three times I've come on here about these satin pillowcases. My hair is the way I want it to be, kind of hunker jawed. And I've heard that satin pillowcases will really smooth your hair and make it pretty if you're trying to keep your coiffure intact during the night. If you're not like me and you don't like your hair hunker jawed like I like mine, you might want to try these satin pillowcases. And besides all that, they're pretty. This one's kind of orange and aqua, and I think that's a lovely color pattern. But you might want to give them a try because I love them. Also, they had window balances. I hadn't noticed those before, and this is a pretty color of red. Y'all know already what I'm going to do with this one, I think. I will be making some sort of hat out of it to wear to a red hat meeting, I can assure you already. I also got an orange one because you know how I feel about orange. I just love it. Also, there's these cool little Kobe earbuds. Now, to me, earbuds are a lot like the bubble wands that I've told y'all about before and about reading glasses, which we will talk about later. You can get all three of those things at Dollar Tree and at those prices, you can afford to keep these things in every room of your house and it's not a bad idea because it's the kind of thing that gets lost every time you turn around. But I loved these because they were hot pink and I couldn't resist them. 
thought they were super cute. Also, this Crayola bathtub finger paint soap. I got it in pink, but they had it in several other colors. And as I've already admitted to y'all before, there's no chillin' living in here with me. And so you know who's going to use this in the bathtub. Me. And I do not mind telling you one little bit. It'll be fun, and I will enjoy it. Also, I can't believe it. I've never seen these before. It's a Campbell soup bowl cozy is that not the cutest thing look at that picture of it wrapped around that bowl it's red and then plaid uh red and white plaid on the inside i thought that was precious and again it's the only one i saw and so whether it comes in other varieties or not i'm not really sure also real quick from a practical standpoint this poster tack um they sell it in dollar tree and it's a handy thing for those of you who may not have ever used poster tack I mean, it's kind of like chewing gum or something, but not. And you just just take off a piece and stick it on something and hang it up. It's a really cool thing. I mean, you can take little notes and stick them all kinds of places or anything. And it comes off easily and goes on easily. And it's pretty able to keep things hanging where you put them. I got a couple of little books. This one says to do like your to do things but two because there's two sweet little flamingos and i love flamingos um the other one i got is this one that says gypsy spirit and i'd have to say it's probably my favorite what i love about these is that they have the um the little ring binder and it's a lot handier to use to write in in a case like that also up here on the wall behind me i have a new little hanging that is a flamingo that says be unique and y'all know that's what i always want to do and that's always what i want to encourage y'all to do do your thing and be you why try to fit in when you were born to stand out y'all have a great week and if anybody finds those lemon dishes please send me some bye